Today, we'll be talking about the top 10 things you will need in Warframe, as well as the greatest tip you will ever need in Warframe. Let's get on with the video. Hello everyone, and welcome to Envy Gaming. I'm your host, Envy, and today, for this video, I thought since we are getting a ton of new players coming to the Switch, or people who are just copying their accounts over to the Switch, I thought it would be best to pick out some of the top 10 things you will need in Warframe, as well as the greatest tip for all the new players out there. So let's begin. Starting off with, with a Warframe. Uh, Frost Prime is great for defense missions, especially for Snow Globe ability and Avalanche. Great for crowd control. If it's you do not have a Frost Prime or there is no Frost Prime currently active in the game, then I would strongly recommend you go to a normal Frost. It works exactly the same. It's just a Prime is better. After that, you're going to need a good weapon. Number two, we have the Heck. The Heck is a great shotgun weapon, and it's great against bosses. And if you've partnered up with Steel Meridian, you can get access to their Vacor Heck. And I just realized I said Vacor Heck up there. That's just the Heck. Another thing I would strongly recommend is the Synthesis Scanner. But when you go there a second time, get the mod that has the Infinity Symbol, as you see there in the center, and get it. It is very helpful. You have Infinity Scans, so you never have to pay for more scans, which is awesome. Another thing I would like to recommend you guys pick up is a Chipper. These things are great for hacking terminals, and they're absolutely amazing and very helpful. You get those from one of the relays. Another thing that I would recommend for is to pick up a Helios. Helios automatically does scans of enemies, which is very useful and helpful. And a great mod for your Sentinels would be Meta Ray. Meta Ray is a great mod that basically it will heal you over time with your, when your Sentinel is nearby, which is awesome. Another thing that I would strongly recommend is you get the Zenuke tree that way because with one of his abil one of the tree's abilities is the energy dash energy dash will create a dome which has which if you walk you go make your warframe go through it you will get energy regeneration for a few minutes or actually for a few seconds my bad and it works out pretty well another thing that i recommend is join a clan joining a clan will be very helpful not only are you part of this big community group but also you will have access to their labs, which allows you to have access to more weapons. As well as, you can decorate the clan and stuff, and help each other out with quests, and trade for items, which is very helpful. Another thing that I recommend you guys getting is linking your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account to have Twitch Prime. And every few months, Warframe will announce a Prime giveaway thing, which is absolutely awesome awesome and it helps out a lot so because you guys get free prime stuff and everything that's prime is better than a normal version and finally a good advice for anyone out there would be set a goal for new players you will have no idea where to go to do i go to venus do i go to mars do i go to the earth what do i do what's all this take it slow just take it slow. Set a goal for yourself and accomplish that goal. That, uh, and accomplish that goal. So just set a goal, accomplish it, make another goal, and accomplish that. That's the best way to figuring out Warframe. And finally, it's now time for the greatest piece of advice that I will give to all you new players. Now this is the biggest problem I had when I was just starting out in Warframe. So here's the greatest thing. Excellent. So the um, one thing is, so the one best advice I'll give you is crit. If it says crit, that's another word for damage. That's all. Dam crit, add it. Basically, damage, and then you add crit, which gives you more damage. It's like a damage multiplier, and it's very helpful. Well, that's it for this video, guys. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video of the top 10 things you will need and the greatest advice ever. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, 
The Nintendo Switch version for Warframe comes out this Tuesday, November 20th. Thanks for watching. This is NV Gaming signing off.